so I wanted to make a video uh, this is about tech so what tech means is the race cars before they can race they have to pass a pretty strict inspection for safety because the Southern California Timing Association which puts on the event doesn't want anybody to get hurt uh, if at all possible so they have the rules in place to uh, help prevent that. So they're checking all the safety stuff. So if you look in front of the engine there, it looks like a uh, couple of pieces of wood, but what it really is, is it's called ballast. And what that does is help balance the car so that it handles better, so that the weight is equally in the front and in the back. But if you notice, they also have it in the rear as well, kind of hidden in the frame rails there, uh, and some back there as well. What that does is that helps to gain traction uh, nothing helps more with traction on the, on the uh, surface than more weight. Otherwise, they can spin the tires and lose control of the race car. So, let's see here. Hopefully, I won't get in trouble wandering around. I'll try to look like I'm supposed to be here, but uh, let's see. As you can see, there's a lot of different combinations and types. There's a lot of nervous people here because they've come a long way and if they were told they can't race, I'm pretty sure they'd be pretty sad. That's what's called a rotary engine. Here's a little Studebaker. I'm guessing it's a 1950 champion. <coughs> I believe the little motor's a, uh, I'm not sure what it is. Maybe an Oldsmobile, maybe a Chrysler. This little car. Pretty serious. And over here, this is where the motorcycles get the okay to run. It's a big motor for a little bike. All right. So that was a pretty good view of what's going on here. These are the cars that are still waiting to get checked out. There's a long line. That's my friend Mike. I'd say hi, but he's busy. He used to work with Mickey Thompson, and then he worked with Danny Thompson. Uh, he was.
was in charge of the parachutes. So he did a great job, him and his son, Mike and Mike. So he's the guy in the orange hat. I want to say hi, but he's busy. I don't want to uh, be a bugaboo there. So, so this little trailer here uh, is where you get your wristbands. And, uh, I think it's also once you pass tech, you get some more stuff. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> well, that's not a good description. This is one of those uh, same kind of trailers. Something to do with official and the car and certifying it. And that you're certified and it's okay. And you got all your COVID paperwork and all that stuff. Here's where you buy crap. Uh, this is my favorite one. Because uh, I buy lots of crap. And I buy lots of crap for other people. Because they like crap too. They all like crap. Uh, you have to get here early. Today's Friday, so of course it's Friday 2021. Um, gosh, I don't even know what the date is, but August 6th, I think. Uh, you kind of lose track after all the traveling and everything. Um, but uh, it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, you get all your shirts and all your stuff, but you got to get there Friday because if you get there Saturday or Sunday, you are S O L, which means you're not going to get anything. So. Okay, so the officials are waving the next car to come on down and they're giving out free pizzas. I'm just kidding. Uh, they're actually just telling them to come down and get your cars inspected. Okay, uh, I'm going to walk back to our truck and our car. Uh, I think I got a pretty good tour of that. Sorry it's such a long video. Uh, I know you probably get bored, you probably already changed it, but that's okay. All right.